All right, and the pick is in for the Washington football team. Now, they need QB, O-line, and D-line help. They could also take a wide receiver. Maybe we see Rashad Bateman here. That'd be a smart pick. Let him learn under Allen Robinson before they lose him. Wait, here... You said D-line. You mean linebacker? Linebacker, yeah, I'm sorry. Yeah, they definitely don't need D-line. No, they don't need D-line. They need linebacker. Thank you. Um, Edge pressure, linebacker, something in that range. Preferably just a straight linebacker here. Uh, we're going to take... I think they take Darisaw. Maybe we see Rashad Bateman here to learn next to Allen Robinson. Either one of those could absolutely be the way this goes. I say Darisaw is the best man available. Mm -hmm. Um, but I would totally understand if they went Rashad Bateman or somebody like Terrence Marshall. Um, who do you think they take here? What are like your top two or top three for who this might be? Now, I will say this. We've been saying Farley has needs to go. They're not taking a lot of chances on injury guys. Mm -mm. Well, Jalen Phillips, but that's other issues. Yeah, so. that is other issues. But I'm, I'm, not, I'm not sold on Bateman going this high. Christian Darisaw would be the great pick here. Morgan Moses is old. He's already said he's going to retire very soon. They need O-line, and Darisaw could learn from one of the legends yep. uh, for Washington Redskins and slash football team. Yeah, that would be a great pick. Now, if they get Jeremiah wusu Koromolo, great pick. But mm -hmm. it does both the question, what is wrong with Darisaw? Yeah, why is he falling so far? What have we not seen today or yesterday or recently that's making him drop out of like I mean, Leatherwood got Leather, taken. Or is it just that Leatherwood's that good? Because, I mean, we were high on Leatherwood before, but not this high. Mm -hmm. I was thinking of, like, maybe the Chiefs before they traded it to Baltimore. Yeah. Or, I mean, I could still see somebody like maybe Denver grabs him in the second or the third, or you have another team with, you know, all line You know, needs. Cosme's fallen, too. Cosby's, Cosme hasn't even been a best fit for yeah. either team yet. Neither is Darisaw. Yeah, well, I'm saying like where it selects best fit on the corner there. We haven't even seen Cosby flash across for anybody or Tevin Jenkins. I think both of those guys may be just completely wiped from first round boards entirely. There's no way Darisoff falls out of the first round though, is there? Like uh, I wouldn't I, think so. I thought he was a lock for the Chargers at 13. Then we saw Slater selection. Jamie Davis? Davis. Slate. Um. The O tackle falls again. Jamin Davis. Dude, so he is not are, going. They are bolstering Ooh. their rush defense. That's going to be a terrifying team. This was a number teams. five defense last year. And then they number get, two in rushing uh, the passer. Man, man, they, they are get Jamin Davis, one of the best defenders in this class. A guy that's been flying up draft boards recently. Where did we have Jamin Davis? He was originally on Baltimore. our board. It's going to Baltimore. Yeah. So then that leaves the question, who do you think Baltimore takes? They still go edge like Jason away, probably, <coughs> I would assume. We'll get there when we get there. Yeah, there's a thousand things that could happen. I will see Cormo and, and Christian Darisol. Oh, the Giants are on the clock. The Giants need, you know, Christian Darisol. But what happens is a real question. This is... Well, we will certainly talk about it in the next video. Yeah. <laughs> wink, wink. We're going to be uploading a lot of stuff tonight when the draft ends, but... What do you think of Jamin Davis beefing up an already terrifying Washington defense, especially as a fan of someone that has to face against them? I mean, him with Chase Young, Montez Sweat. Yeah. <laughs> Just saying. Dak Martin to center, Lyle Collins to guard, and Slater at right tackle was not looking that bad. That's true. <laughs> You could still grab Cosme and try to flip people around but with him. Oh, come on. We already have one Texas <laughs> tackle. Hey, the, wh why not take the home guy? You're um, right, you're but right. This is interesting. I don't think any board in existence projected any of this stuff going on the way it has. Mm -hmm. um, we're going to go ahead and cut the YouTube video here. We'll be back in a few minutes when the New York Giants select uh, their player. Christian Darisol makes a lot of sense. Before we cut it, who do you think... Uh, the Giants go with here. Got to be Christian Darisol now. You'd have to. I mean, he's fallen um, seven or eight picks past where we originally had him at the Chargers, so he's got to go somewhere. Yeah. And the Giants are a great pick. They need to keep Danny Dimes safe. They need to see if Daniel Jones is the answer. And a guy like Darisol would give you, you know, just say whether or not he's the guy. But we will be back in a few minutes, so thank you. Uh, for those of you in the stream, of course, stay tuned, and we'll be back in a few minutes.